Stopping school violence before it happens, that's what one lawmaker wants to do. And as Kimberly Speakman reports, he's hoping to start a pilot program at local schools. This is New at 9. The bill would establish a pilot program for a team that would look for and handle any potential school threat before it happens. So this was an idea that was born from that and community feedback to help uh, try to reduce the amount of violence in our schools. Representative Ryan Yamane says staff would learn how to detect a threat. Offer training to school staff and teachers about you know what to look for, what are signs of anger, bullying, violence, and then also come up with a plan on how the conflicts can work together to address these kind of situations. It would also set up a system for getting information out to the public quickly. The frustration that parents have. Uh, is not getting information quick enough or accurate. And so the hope is then with something like this, uh, with outside entities assisting, we can make sure the right information, um, the most accurate and the most timely, can get out to the community. And set up additional ways for students to get counseling. Not only with the training with the staff, but also finding a system of care in which then entities like, for example, the Red Cross, who provides mental health counseling, could be contacted. Um, there could be integrated with already the DOE system for counseling. The proposal would also set up an anonymous reporting system so people can report threats and a database that would collect these reports along with others from the police. As for how much funding the program could receive when it starts, that's something that still needs to be decided at the state legislature. Kimberly Speakman, KHON2 News, working for Hawaii.